Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be reviewing and showing off the brand Flesh. So this brand is available on Ulta.com and at select Ulta beauty stores. So this video is in partnership with Ulta. Um, so I'm going to be reviewing this new brand, um, kind of like a first impressions. I went to Ulta to pick out some of the products. Um, I got mostly a full face right here. A lot of these products are like very natural looking. Um, hence the name Flesh. So this brand was created by the founder of Allure magazine and her name is Linda Wells. So the motto of the brand is kind of like Flesh turns nude makeup into a strong statement. And they have a shade for every skin tone. The, they do have a foundation range of 40. So it also include highlighters, lipsticks, blushes, eyeshadows, um, which I'll get to later. So you guys will see a little bit of those and how they apply. All right guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and start with my makeup. So first I'm going to take the foundation. Here's what it looks like. This is a stick foundation, so it is cream. And I'm going to be using the shade Custard, which is 08. All right, so this is how much foundation comes inside of it. There is 0.16 ounces. All right, so I'm gonna take this little guy. I'm just gonna, you know, paint my face with it. Honestly, I have not used stick foundation in probably over a year. So I'm gonna use my Beauty Blender to apply, which I suggest because it is thick and just this will help, you know, blend it out a little bit better. So that foundation was a little bit light for me, so I'm going to paint Latte over and kind of blend them together. Alright, so here's the foundation on. It's pretty dewy as you can see. So as you can see, this foundation has really good coverage. It looks pretty full coverage to me. They say it's medium, but I feel like you can definitely build it up to full. Or you could even sheer it out to be like a light coverage. Alright, so for foundation, I'm going to use the darker shade that I got. Um, this is called Latte. This is number 20. All right, so now I'm going to conceal. So on the um, display for the foundations, it said you can use it as concealer or contour. So I'm gonna go ahead and use shade three to conceal and highlight my face. All right, so here is the concealer on. As you can see, my face is like literally full coverage after doing contour, foundation, and concealer. Um, so I actually am really digging this, like this coverage is sick. All right, so I'm gonna take my damp beauty blender and dip it into some loose powder. This is translucent powder. And I'm going to just go right underneath my eyes and set my under eyes. You definitely wanna set this cause it's cream and it's gonna transfer and crease and everything, so. All right, so here is the base down. I just packed powder all over my face, as you've seen. So I do really like these little foundations. Um, they worked good as foundation, obviously, contour and concealer. So it's kind of nice to have three in one, kind of, so. All right, so now I'm going to move on to blush. So here is the blush. So here's the packaging and I have shade Hug. All right, so I'm gonna tap into that and with just a really soft natural brush. I don't wanna apply too much. Tap off the brush a little bit. All right, so I do love that blush color. I like to have a nice warm, like orangey terracotta blush. All right, next, I'm going to highlighter. This is a powder highlight. This is called Jump. Um, that's what the shade is. This is like a nice champagne white gold shade. All right, so here's the highlighter. I absolutely love this highlighter. This is probably like one of my favorite highlighters I've ever used because there's no cast. It's super like um, like thin, so it like doesn't look like it's on top of your skin. There's no glitter. All right, so next is the Flesh Eyeshadow Palette and here's what it looks like. So there are nine shades. These are all pretty neutral. There's a pop of pink at the top. The top two rows are shimmers. The bottom is uh, matte and then there's a mirror. All right, so my eyes are pretty much primed. I just put the foundation on top of my eyelids. So I'm just gonna go ahead and like rub out any creasing that I have. Just kind of even out all that product with my finger. And I'm gonna go ahead with a translucent powder that I set my face with and just pack that on top. 
This will help all the eyeshadows blend very nicely. All right, so I'm gonna grab this shade right here called Touch on a blending brush. I'm going to pop that onto my crease as a transition shade. Come on, pigment. All right, I'm gonna grab this brown right here. This is called Nerve. I'm gonna pop that a little bit into the crease, a little bit lower than the transition shade. I'm gonna use a smaller, more concentrated blending brush for that. I also forgot to mention that the palette does come with a little brush like this. All right, so I'm gonna tap a little bit into the black eyeshadow. I'm gonna put that right on the outer corner. All right, so I'm gonna take that medium brown and put that right on the edge of the black. So I'm gonna kind of copy the crease. So I'm gonna put the black right here and put the medium brown right here and then the light brown in the inner corner. All right, so I'm gonna grab this shimmery shade up here. This is like a champagne. This is called Unveil. I'm going to put that right into the inner corner right here. So first I'm gonna try it without any side spray. I'm not gonna get wet or anything, just gonna do it dry. All right, so that looks really good. That's actually pretty shimmery, pretty, pretty pigmented, but I am gonna get it wet just so it's a little bit more intense. All right, so I'm gonna grab the light shimmery shade right here called Expose. I'm gonna pop that into my inner corner and I'm also gonna put that on my brow bone. All right, so for the lower lash line, I'm going to grab that medium brown once again. I'm gonna take a thin brush and I'm going to run that underneath the lower lash line. All right, so I'm gonna take the black on a little tiny brush. This one is pretty pointed. So I'm just gonna use this one and I'm gonna tuck it right onto the very outer corner of the bottom lash line and meet it up with the eyelid. All right, so I'm gonna grab that transition shade and I'm gonna do that on a fluffy brush, a little tiny one, and run that under the lower lash line. This will help blend out those darker shades. All right, guys, so the eyes are done. As you can see, I just popped on some lashes. So the eyeshadow, Blended out really well, as you can see, it's pigmented. Looks really good. All right, guys, so I'm gonna move on to lipstick. So here's what the lipstick looks like. I have the shade Heart, which is like a nice true red. All right, guys, so here's the lipstick. As you can see, it went on really easily. All right, so as you can see, it has like a kind of a little like a creamy finish. It feels like it's in between a matte and like a, a cream, if you know what I mean. All right, so I really like this lip color. It is super pigmented, as you can see. It feels so good on my lips. All right, guys, so my favorite products from this whole collection would probably be the highlighter would be the number one thing because it just looks like it's your skin. It's not glittery. It literally does not leave a cash. You can like pack it on. Um, you can definitely do like soft, like a soft highlight, or you can really pack it on and do like a super blend highlight like this. Um, and the lip feels so comfortable, like, as you can see, it's so, like, it's, like, even. There's no, like, weirdness, patchiness. It feels really nice. And, yeah. So, if you guys want any of these products, don't forget to check them out at Ulta, um, online and in store. Alright, guys, so thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to my channel if you have not already. And I hope to see you guys in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. Deuces.